beauty and the novel coronavirus. An uneasy mix indeed. Customers in Thailand continue to cling to their favorite beauty treatments. Now, while the beauty industry puts a brave face on in a bad situation, our next report gives you more detail. There is a fine line between need and want. At least that's what we'd like to believe when enough time, boredom and borderline desperation has us fighting thread and blade with overgrown eyebrows. With the beauty salons and clinics out of the running for more than two months now, our routine indulgences are starting to seem more and more like essential services. Because for many, beauty is a daily pick-me-up in these difficult times. The Thai beauty clinics have thus revamped their work practices with new mini face masks for up-close beauty treatments. The Valirat clinic, where customers receive a variety of cosmetic treatments, has devised these beauty-specific masks. The idea being to let the doctor conduct procedures while limiting contact with the nose and the mouth. Uh, I was so happy because earlier I had not been able to get my face done at all. And now we have this innovation. I think it's so great and I feel so much safer while getting treated as well. Beauty treatments have become taboo amid the pandemic. Even as the general populace are primed to make a mad dash to the nearest beauty clinic, there is much work in store for the ones tasked with running these outlets. Apart from the protective mini masks, social distancing has become the guiding principle for many at the Valira clinic. The number of customers have been limited to 15 each day from more than 100 previously. Temperature screenings, other health checks have become a part of the new normal. Thus, a different type of staple has become essential to get through the challenging days ahead.